Alrighty, and we should be live. Awesome. Sick. We are live. Hey, I um, want to just give a quick apology to everyone. Sorry about those technical issues that we were having. Um, the venue in which we were at. Uh, venue which we were at uh, had a really slow upload speed. Wasn't optimal for streaming. So here we are. We are ready to go. Just got to let him know the streamer is indeed ready. How is everybody doing today? My name is Rusty. I'll be your caster for today's game. Uh, today we are witnessing the game between Wake Tech and... Sorry, let me pull up my notes here. Uh, the College of Beaver County and from Pennsylvania. So, super excited to see... What we got going on here, I believe we already had a, let's see, let me get a head count here. Alrighty, just want to make sure everybody can hear me correctly, right? Yeah, it should be good. How's the volume, everyone? Let me know how everything sounds to you guys. Perfect. Thank you so much, Coach, for doing that. Great. I'm really excited to see today's game. Looks like we're going to be on bind. Always puts me in a bind. <laughs> now nah, I'm playing around. <laughs> Let's see. But uh, yeah, feel free to leave any comments. If you have any questions for uh, me or the team, I'll try to answer as best as I can. Uh, obviously, we're trying to play with some new ideas today. Uh, so things may not... Uh, so we're going to try some things over the next few weeks with streaming and all that kind of stuff. Make it a little bit more of a fun experience for everyone. Uh, so any suggestions you guys have, we'd love to hear it. And uh, we'll go from there. So, this is my first time casting, so, um, but I've been playing Valorant for a little bit, uh, love playing with my friends, it's a good time, love Valorant, watch the Masters, you know, like watching the greats, uh, all that fun stuff. Seems like we're gonna have, uh, Beaver County start on defense, which means that we're going to be on the attacker side for this round. How is everybody's day going? Hope yours is going well. Mine's been a little bit of a hectic day. Had a race from the venue in which we were at. And here we are. We are about to get started. Now, I was able to catch a few of the other uh, Wake Tech Esports games, and I gotta say, I am very impressed with the team comp that we got on our side. Uh, they seem to communicate very well. They get their picks, they go in, they make their moves. It's great. Um, just to update on the score, we won the first round. So right now, it's uh, uh, and when it was a 13 to 1 game, so it was a, almost a shutout. Uh, but uh, 
which is great plays from both sides. Love to see it. And uh, for the pistols round. Now, one of my favorite things about 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 bind is uh, the versatility of the map. You know, you can really push hard A for a while, or you can push any one of the sites, and you can rotate very quickly. Um, so that's always great to see. Looks like we got four. Sorry. All right, looks like we're going for a... Uh... All righty. All right, so here we're starting out. Here we got Rays pushing out with a... Pushing out. There they are. Looks like they're pushing B long here. Take flight. And let's see if they can get any picks. All right, they uh, Arsh picking off Ko and Bipip picking off Arsh. It's a nice little trade there. Picking off the Omen. They're pushing onto the site. Gotta make sure they check those corners. And they're noticing that there's gonna be some in CT. Right now, the numbers are in their favor as they have this amazing, aggressive push onto B. They're just waiting for those picks. They're 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 kind of stuck in that corner. They're gonna want to push that out. Oh, they got sighted. They know that they're in there. There's not much place for them to go. They got a four v two right now. Five v two. Four v two. My bad. Right here. One enemy remaining. And that's going to pretty much solidify the round for Wake Tech here. Last player standing. And with the omen and the sky still alive. Yep. Win for the attackers. That was a great play there. Nice aggressive push as they pushed onto the site. They took control very well. Um... But at the very end, you know, they could have had it if they just were able to get those picks just a little bit faster. But great play from both sides. Alright. Seems like this time we're going for an A push. They're kind of sneaking on. Sage walled off A short. So they're gonna have to go around through showers if they want to push onto A or shoot down the wall. Looks like they're trying to grab attention. They're kind of holding their position. Standing ahead. Are they gonna get that pick? Not quite. Healing with the, from the sky. Let's see what they're doing over here. All right. Taken out. All right. Picked off the sage. Got that's the healer. And they picked off another. So now they're down four to three. They can just come around and One pick the enemy up. remaining. And that's pretty much gonna seal the deal unless this omen can pick off four. And it's another win for the attackers. Two to zero wake tech. The aggression from the aggression that we're seeing from Wake Tech is actually is actually pretty great. You know. I, I, this, is, this is just fun for me to watch. Um, the best thing I think the best thing that they, that the other team can do to kind of to kind of you know go against this strat is to you know is to uh, work on getting those picks. Uh, you know when one peeks out, you know they gotta they gotta really click those heads. You know uh, it's really uh, it's really important that they do that. But it doesn't. Let's see. Go get him. Going for our B push. We've got Ray's pushing out. Picks off the Omen. Pushing in through Hookah. We got also got Sova pushing through B Long with the drone. Not seeing anyone yet. They're kind of staying in hidden, staying out of sight. Of course, he spotted the Raina. Raina took out the drone. 
And it seems like we got a full stack. The, the entire team has rotated over to B. So it looks like they're moving over to A to, for a sneaky plant going through teleporter. So it means they're going to have to rotate back over to A. I don't know if they're going to make it in time because they pretty much have control of, this, of the A site. Here they go for the plant. Here we go with Rays watching back site. Sage is looking very carefully. Wasn't able to get the pick. Having their vision. One. And they're getting their picks. They're getting their picks. KO's coming from it. There. Attacker spawn, and that's another win for Wake Tech. Yeah, so Valorant is a strategic 5v5 shooter. Um, it's a, it's objective-based, so there's two objectives. It's either eliminate the enemy team, or it's going to be plant the spike and defend. Um, so one side is the attackers, the other side are defenders. Um, and uh, it's it's a really strategic game. It's all about, you know, pacing, about st strategy, aim, and... Um, and using utility as well. Each uh, each agent, as they're called, has uh, different powers, different abilities. Like for example, uh, the character we're on right now, Jet, is a great uh, is a great duelist, meaning they're really good at one v ones, really charging in and being aggressive. Uh, Omen is a uh, Omen is really good at kind of taking control of a site. Um, they can put down you know smokes um, and kind of blind the enemy. One enemy remaining. Flawless. That was just a absolutely. I'm, I'm sorry that I didn't uh, kind of. I uh, just had a curiosity. Are there openings? What are the requirements to be a part of the esports team? Now I know at the beginning of the season they did have tryouts, uh, and if you have more questions about that, make sure to join our Discord, and we'll have more information when tryouts are and how you can join the esports team, all that fun stuff. Uh, we also do have, uh, uh, you know, we got we got a few we got a few different teams. We got Rocket League, you know, here at Wake Tech, so. Definitely uh, make sure you're a part of that Discord to get that information. Yeah. All right, so we got another B push here. We see Ray's over at A trying to get some picks. Let's see, they're, uh, Raina got picked off by their Jet and by Jazz. They picked off the Omen as well. Another B push. They pretty much got control of the site. And uh, you're going to be able to plant. Are they going to be able to... Are th Is Beaver County going to be able to take it back? One enemy remaining. And with that, their Sage is the lone person from their team. She's kind of in a stuck position. She's not in a favorable position, and that's another point for the attackers. Yeah, that's... Again, we're seeing some amazing team comp here from Wake, Wake Tech. Uh, I'm a little biased myself, because we like to... You know, after every round. <laughs> I like to say to give him the beak. Uh, it's an old, old thing from that I, uh, I remember from a long time ago. So, again, really great team comp here from Wake Tech. I know that Beaver County is putting up their best fight right now. Let's see. Uh, hopefully they can kind of maybe sneak in a round or two there for their win. Uh, so that's not a complete washout for them. Cover going out. All right, so we got Sof over here oh, trying to dart. Oh, Omen's up there. This is the dart, no! which would allow uh, Sova and the rest of the team to be able to see where they are. Right. right now it's 4v2. They pretty much got... Con oh, and their jet was picked off. Now it's a 3v2. They pretty much have control of... Down, B. And now it's a 2v2. Spike is still on B, so Sova and uh, so and the Wake Tech is going to have to coordinate to be able to take back their spike because um, if they don't plant in time, it's actually a loss. So the sky's the sky's got to be very careful because they can get picked off very easily. One enemy remaining. Oh, that was a nice little pick. Oh, and and now it's going to be one v one. Sky's going to be holding, watching sight on that spike while Sova's coming there. around for the flank. Looks like Sky is kind of anticipating a flank. 
Not really too sure what's going on, but they should, they're going to hold. And that's a win for Wake Tech. As, uh, as they take him out. A side does not exist. You know, there's, there'd be, there's a really great thing about, uh, knowing when to plant which site, you know, is kind of, kind of a tricky thing, you know? It's, it's kind of true that people kind of tend to prefer B site because of the different corners and angles in which you can attack and hold in. A is very open, and trying to push in through showers is not always the smartest idea because, you know, you can get blindsided very quickly. Someone could be hiding up over on the other side. It's a very risky, you know, it's, it can be very risky to push through there. So we got Raves and we got Sova pushing in on Wake Tech's side through showers. They picked off the sky and they're starting to push on to A site. Rain has been picked off. Now it's a 5v3. Now the rest of the team, rest of Beaver County is trying to come in. They're planning on site. Like right now, Wake Tech has complete control of the site. As uh, Beaver County tries to pick their way in. They're playing pretty conservatively right now. Looks like they're going to try and avoid heaven. They got three people focused on the right there. And an absolutely flawless play again from Wake Tech. Just absolute aggression and great communication coming from them about where they are, where they're planting their angles. Fantastic. And that's going to leave us to 7 0. So uh, in Valorant, it's going to be the first of 13. Um. Is going to be winning the round best of three. So if Wake Tech beats, if Wake Tech uh, finishes this one, the first round is going to go to uh, Wake Tech. I'll find them. Standing ahead. All right, so they're going for another B push, being a little bit conservative on the B long side. He'll throw his grenade to kind of try and uh, suppress some of the uh, suppress wake tech, but was a little bit unsuccessful there. Uh, and they, Beaver County is able to take out the sky, and we got some trades here. Now it's a two v three or three v two. My bad. Like we got a flank coming from Omen here, coming to take the back site, and they were able to pick out the sky. The last character is going to be Reyna, who's coming in through Hookah. And it's another win for Wake Tag. So Wake Tech is going to take Nationals in Valorant this season, right? That's a great question. Um, I actually have no idea right now. <laughs> 13-0, it's, it, you know what, I'm sh I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm kind of hoping for Beaver County to just get one win, you know? This, this, this map tends to be a very attack-heavy map. It's great for attackers, and, um, also, it's a, it's, it can be somewhat balanced. It really depends on your team comp. If you're aggressive in terms of planning, you can really get in there and, uh, you can really get in there and just plant super fast, honestly. Cover going out. All right, we got Jet rotating back over to B. They're pushing through Hookah right now. They were able to pick off the Sky and Arena as well. So we got Omen trying to go in. Unable to pick off the other Omen. They're pretty much got control of the B side if they just push in right now. While the other two, while the Sky and KO on the other opposing team is rotating over to try and defend B. Beaver County's in a bit of a sticky situation considering that they're still in attacker spawn and if they push out just the tiniest bit, uh, they're going to get picked off very quickly. And it looks like Omen clouded in the entrance or the entrance into the back site. And we got a really aggressive push from the jet, but they were eliminated. Beaver County, if they're going to want to take this win, they're going to have to really move. The Sage is still back sight in CT. And that's going to be another win for Wake Tech. Oh. 
again, just really great aggression from Wake Tech. I kind of feel like I'm a broken record right now, but I'm just I'm just in awe seeing all these play and seeing these players um, move move in so quickly. They seem to be flawless in their communication. Um, just really impressed overall. Looks like we got a <laughs> we got a jet with an op. And we'll see, we'll see what happens with uh, this jet. Looks like they got a little bit of a split push. Uh, pushing onto A site. Breaking through the Sage's wall, trying to push onto A. Revealing area. Looks like jet is rotating back to A site. And it looks like our, their sky, our sky was picked off and we picked off their sky, sky for sky. After Hunter! <laughs> And that's gonna be that's gonna be two with the ultimate that uh, Plast was able to take out. I'm gonna go for the plant right now. Sage and Omen they seem to be the end game champions all the time, and they were able to pick off the Sage right now. Omen is back sight. Gotta be very careful here. And that's another win for Wake Tech. It seems I got pranked today because uh, Coach. Uh, told me that after every round, uh, you guys go, ah! but apparently that's a lie, but I don't care. It's staying. I want after every round, after every round, right? That's a win for Wake Tech. That's going to be another ah! in the chat. <laughs> oh, man. All right, we got another B push here, and oh, well, let's see what Jet's doing with the op. Absolutely nutty shot there. Take the sky is all alone on B. Their teammates are gonna have to rotate over there, and they have complete control of site B. They can just hold it down. It's another round for Wake Tech, yeah, as well because all the. Interesting wall there as they go for the revive using the Sage's ult. And Jet is holding the <laughs> it's holding the holding C2 with the op and it's just absolutely annihilating everyone. Three kills for both the Rays and the Jet. Last round. Absolutely incredible. I've got an eagle screech I use every time I score an RL. May have to put those on the external for your coach. Uh, feel free to send those to me. Uh, I would love to have that on my soundboard. <laughs> Looks like we're gearing up for another B push. I mean, we're pretty much all stacked out in terms of uh, gunfare there. So I was using their dart kind of see what's going on jets going in with the full ult now with the last patch jets ult has been nerfed a little bit so instead of having 10 knives they actually only get five Let's see what happens here oh another kill go for the plant right now it's 3v2 blinding Going For those who want to see the kills and the stat and strats right now, right now we got a uh, raised top fragging, 19 kills, four deaths. Looks like the one enemy remaining. Absolutely fantastic job from Opidet, Opidets, Opis. It looks like the rain is trying to either save or using their ult to make an aggressive push, but I don't think they're going to make it in time. That that spike's going to blow up, and the element's going to go ahead and take him out, and that's another win for Wake Tech. Switching sides. Match point. And we got a giant gh from all players there for a good half an incredible 
shutout. 12 to 0. <laughs> so it looks like we're going for a split, a split defense. We got three on B, two on A. Right now we got uh, Jazz has a ghost. Looks like everyone else has either a shorty or a classic. So like being very careful, seeing how, you know, they a little bit's on the line here. Sky is going to be encountering the team here in a bit. They're going for a full push, full five-person push through a short. Absolutely incredible. Three taken out right there by the Sky. Absolutely incredible. Our, oh, so close for that ace. And we go for a second win. Defenders win. Congratulations, Waytech. Wow, that was that was a uh, that was a very quick game. Again, incredible precision and aggression from Wake Tech here. We can take a look and let's take a look here at uh, the review of the round. Obviously, we see that it's thirteen to zero, uh, which is just an incredible shutout. We got uh, Arsh here with twenty with an average combat score of four hundred twelve. Uh, that's 20 kills, 4 deaths, and 8 assists. Absolutely incredible player right there, top fragging this game. And uh, just all around, great, uh, great, like I said, great communication, great team play. Uh, just absolutely incredible. Uh, thank you so much to... <laughs> Sorry. Uh, thank you so much to Beaver County for coming out and playing us, who gave us their best shot. And... Uh, Fortunately for us, that's another win on our tally. Um, so, uh, a very short, like I said, a very short game, but uh, it seems like everyone was uh, putting in their best effort. Um, let's see. Uh, yeah, so, again, my name is Rusty. You can find me on Discord in either the... You can find us on Discord using the link down below, which you find down there. Come and chat with us. Come and ask questions. Uh, come and leave suggestions for uh, casting. Um, we are definitely more than open to kind of making this more of a, uh, you know, community experience. Um, and any and all feedback would be awesome. So thank you guys so much for joining us. That is going to be all for today. You guys have a lovely week. Keep up your studies. Get good grades. All that fun stuff. And this will be Rusty signing off.